What is going on, YouTube? It is Brick Revolution here with my one and only co-host today, Cheap Ass Bricks. Fick and Bricks is on suspension another week in the house for him. Uh, we don't like the stuff he's been bringing to the table, so we put him in the uh, the box. So anyway, we're here. <laughs> the timeout chair. <laughs> yeah, what, what, I'm trying to get on this website for news, but it's all this freaking cookies. Not, I don't garbage. Cookies. It's garbage. What's up, gang? Got a game seven tonight in the NLCS. Dude, I don't care about these cookies except whatever. Cookies. I love cookies. For F's sake. Uh, bunch of stuff going on football. In the Lego world, I have... Lego world. Done some stuff. All right, there's no news here. All right, uh, what's up, cheap ass? How you doing? We got in the chat. Hang on a little bit. We got Haley Bricks. I haven't seen. Grease Monkey. Haley Bricks. Cold Water. Hauling the Ball. Cold Water. Cheap ass. Brick Revolution. Brick Ovator. Donnie is here. Who's your? What's up, Who's your? So, uh, cheap ass. It is my yeah. honor to say that. Uh, hello, Brooklyn Bricks in the chat. Well, no ad for tonight. Yeah, we probably lost our monetization. Who the hell knows? Pretty soon, uh, I'm I'm in I'm in the works right now to acquire the Hall and Ball Network, and I'm gonna move it to my channel. So, stay tuned for that. Anyway, cheap ass. What's up? What do you got there? What's up? What's up? What's I just up? What's up? some of my recent purchases. You know, the San Diego comic, San Diego Comic Con or fandom. Wonder Wonder Woman got the up, Bob? couple uh toadies and then the grandiose which whoa, I started whoa, whoa, whoa. To oh toady I think it's a toady yeah toady toad the toad yeah. house which is you know it's it's a fun little set I actually I I bought two one one to build one to keep in the box just for whatever mm -hmm, mm -hmm. and then uh I started collecting GI Joe GI Joe wow you know? wow you guys heard it here first folks cheap ass is getting on a Lego I'm not getting out of Lego but I'm <clears throat> You know, my wife was like, don't you dare. Don't you dare start collecting action figures again. I'm like, I couldn't say no. So this is uh, this was supposed to be released at San Diego Comic-Con. Hang on. Brooklyn, Brooklyn said he he returned the Toad set. Yeah. He returned it. Oh, yeah. oh, am I being delivered food? He bought, he bought two men. And they're not. Yeah, uh, I think I'm being not, delivered food. Hang on. They're not selling a million dollars. Like. Oh yeah, I'm being delivered food. I'm on mute. This is uh, one of the San Diego Comic Con exclusive action figures. So we can thank Darth Hall for getting me into this series. But I bought myself a Cobra Commander special edition. So. I just I mean. had a beautiful I plate of food. It has scalloped potatoes. Turkey on it. Was this a squash of some sort with some brown sugar on it? And I think these are zucchini of some sort. So I'm zucchini. here. Zucchini. So keep talking. Keep keep so, talking. So I'm I'm starting to collect GI Joe again. I don't know where I'm going to put them. Uh, I am I am going through a. I don't know if you guys saw my Instagram post. I was I bought a collection off a guy at his coffee shop. He owns a coffee shop. Two trash bags filled with Lego pieces. Uh, in there is the Ninjago City, Brick Bank, uh, Taj Mahal, Saturn V, the UCS Microscale Hogwarts. The Hogwarts right there. Um, uh, they had a fake uh, Super Star Destroyer. I did find a Tuxedo Mickey from the Disney Castle in there as well. So I don't know if there's a Disney Castle mixed in there. There might be. Um, and so far, I'm going through all the pieces, weeding out the fake ones, um, putting them in colors, and then I'm going to inventory the sets. So once once all that is done, uh, all that will be for sale. So, you know, if anybody's interested. So. Fantastic story. What's going on, Willie? Welcome. Uh, who else popped in? Random popped in. Yeah. So you got you got this trash bag haul. Now were they in hefty bags or were they in like little white bags? Uh, big, uh, big black trash bags. Donnie wants the Hogwarts man. Okay. I will. Well, that's, uh, I, you know, that's a great transition because we're going to the news right now while I eat in between news segments because I'm I haven't eaten since probably six a.m. Um. Hang on, share screen here. Application window. Hogwarts. Uh, 
Lego is uh, cutting ties with J.K. Rowling over some views. So every Lego uh, fig is on suspension, minifig collector. Uh, have fun, Hoosier. Appreciate it. Uh, Lego is cutting ties with Harry Potter and burning all the Harry Potter sets because uh, J.K. Cool. Rowling set some stuff on uh, some uh, some Twitter. Yeah, next item, please. I agree. Well, Lego Group had to release a statement because that's what they do about everything nowadays. Blah, 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 blah. What's up, BSB? That is that is a cool little set. The Book of Monsters coming out here. Yeah, it has wheels on the bottom, so when you like scoot it along, it like opens and closes. So this is the Lego Harry Potter Monsters Book of Monsters three zero six two eight. It is revealed. Um, I'm trying to release flyers with Harry Potter Monsters. It's a free gift with purchase set. Interesting, interesting. Yep, and I. Hmm. 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 Mm -hmm. So there was, there, I don't know if you're able to pull it up, but the whole there's a leaked whole list of new sets coming out. Yeah, hang on, I can I can pull it. Oh, the Dolphins just beat the Jets twenty four to nothing. Go Dolphins! Oh, well, they beat the Jets. Brick Blaze on Twitch holding down. Yeah, we'll pull it up after. Anyway, this is a set. It has wheels on it, but it's not remote control. So why is it? What, what do you care if it has wheels? You're gonna. No, you push it. Once you, you oh, push it, you like, lock open and closes. Okay. Okay. It's cool. Yeah. Cool idea. There's a little video of it. I love how they already have it, and they're just showing it off. Yeah, look at it. Look at it. Oh, it's going to go off the table. Uh, what else? Not much on the news. I mean, Lego Mindstorms Robot Inventor Designer Video. They published a designer video on this, so... You you is this one you excited for any of these? Do you have any? Yeah. No. Any mindstorm stuff? No. I, I will probably buy the Porsche if it comes out, but no, I don't. I I, I mean I bought that collection of uh ten mindstorm kits that I haven't gone through yet, but no. That's that those are for resale. <laughs> not not none to keep. Yeah, I don't have any uh experience with them. I mean they are good. Um like you can do a lot with them if you can know how to code them and mock them and stuff. But I don't have any experience with them. But maybe one day. How to check if you won the Lego DC Fandom Super Minifig Girl? Did you enter this? Did you enter this cheap ass cover? I got I to eat well, for a second. Cover. All right. So DC Fandom was a really cool event. They did a virtual because uh, the, everybody knew that San Diego Comic Con was, was not happening. So DC created their own two day event where you got to see new projects. Um, new movies like behind the scenes and new trailers for new new stuff coming out. Um, this was a giveaway that when you went to a site, you had to put in your name. I think you got up to 10 entries per person uh, through different sources. But the first day when the, the link was supposed to work, it didn't work. Or when I did it, it didn't work. So and then I guess people did do it correctly. And now they are starting to arrive in people's homes. Funny thing, and funny thing is, there's about fourteen hundred and fifty figures of this made. This figure right now on eBay, I looked it up last night, is going for about six hundred dollars. So, I mean, you're you're talking about a San Diego Comic Con. I mean, Deadpool Duck wasn't even going for six hundred dollars. When it first came out, this fig is going for six hundred dollars, people. So, if you win it, and you don't care about San Diego Comic Con figs, I would uh, resell it. <laughs> yeah, uh, mini fig mocks and more did do uh do um. Yeah, I'm going to sold. Hang on. Yeah, do sold. Four eighty, four eighty nine. Crazy. Yeah. Five hundred. I mean, I'd sell it in a heartbeat. I can give two. Uh, dude, it would be three. so fast. It would be so fast online. Yeah. And it's new seat for Supergirl because of the TV show. It's cool. It's really cool. I think the hair piece looks weird. Um, but I mean, it's great. Great for people who actually did it. But uh, I think one person got two by mistake. Um, but yeah. So that's. I can't, I can't wait till I show up in a fifteen dollar junior set. Yeah. I mean, you know, who knows? Who knows? But uh, yeah, that's that's that. 
I wish I I saw this the other day. I wish they would release this as a set. Uh, the Lego. It's it's probably gonna be the employee gift this year. The Christmas Millennium Falcon. That would be yeah. that would be awesome. Mm hmm. Mm hmm. That looks really cool. But you get if you enter this mock contest, you win a lot. I mean, you can just build that. If you if you can build if you can win a mock contest, you should be able to build this yourself. Just saying. Not really nothing crazy, just a million falcon with some stuff on it. Mm -hmm, mm -hmm. Brooklyn paid $150 for Barb. Yeah. Wow. Well, Barb is probably going to go up if they end up doing a uh, the mall scene, which I know. Right, I know she's, not, she's not in the mall. Yeah, I know, but any time you mention Stranger Things or any time a new season comes out, anything Stranger Things goes back up. Mm -hmm. You know, just like anything. Mm. Mm -hmm. Sorry, guys. This acorn squash is absolutely delicious. So, uh, you know that Amazon uh, City Donut Opening Shop is on sale. Go buy this piece of crap that's overpriced. Lego Ideas Castle achieves ten thousand supporters. It's neat. It is neat. Not gonna get made. Nah, too much. Did you see the leaks of the uh, Sesame Street? Yes, yes, I it's did. Like, it's like a quarter of the fan made version. Hmm. Not surprised. Here's another San Diego Comic Con that turned into a an entry. So if you want to try winning a Miles Morales minifig, uh, you can enter this contest. It's supposed to be a San Diego Comic Con. Now Willie Trombones is sometimes I don't think Lego City makes sense. No, I, always, I agree. It's, it's always all, all over the place sometimes. It's always on fire. Yeah, <laughs> it's on fire, or it's just a random assortment of stuff. Yeah, so this is again is Miles Morales. It's the same. I think it's the same fig you get in uh, another set that we got Miles Morales in. It's just you get it in the packaging. But again, this will be a San Diego Comic Con, you know, hundred and fifty to two hundred dollar fig once everybody starts receiving them. So that's interesting. The, you know. Interesting. Question about San Diego Comic Con: Does everybody like that they get the chance of owning or getting the San Diego Comic Con, and you don't mm, have to mm -hmm, scalper mm -hmm. prices? <clears throat> now I know that the frigate was up up on sale on Amazon, uh, and that pre order sold out already, so you can't you can't get it. Can't so, it wasn't even up there with a picture of the frigate. Yeah, it was gone. Like it, they had it, and it was gone. Hmm. Daniel Clark says, "I think exclusives hurt the Lego brand in the long run." What? Hmm. Oh, they hurt them. I okay, think they, they hurt interest. Then I will. Then I will. Then I will do one better. Do you think exclusives hurts the Lego brand, or do you think giving it the retired title hurts Lego? Brand. Now that now that Lego is starting to re-release sets, we're starting to see old expensive figures like the adult Ahsoka, even though it's a different printing, come back into the stream. I mean Amazon Amazon right now has the 501st battle pack and the AAT both on sale on Amazon. On sale like a discount or on sale like available? No, it, it was a discount. I think the uh, AAT, AAT was like thirteen twenty five. Mm. And I know that that one figure, the uh, Commando thing that comes in that set, is going for a lot. I think like fifteen dollars by itself. Oh, I didn't know. I have to go buy some if they have them still. Brooklyn says Davivi has good discounts. ZVV does does have good discounts. If you don't mind uh, damaged boxes, or European you, packaging. Yeah, well, you, usually what they do is they just stick the stickers, the shipping stickers, on the box. Yeah, that's not gonna that's not gonna affect the resale value at all. <laughs> yeah, no. yeah. I, I, I don't think it will. I think it's fine. Uh, they're not on sale anymore. All right. Well, they were. They were on. They were on either Friday or Saturday. Whenever. Oh, I you didn't them. tell me. Thanks, buddy. I said it in the chat thread, dude. Check your check your text messages. I am okay. I wasn't I wasn't running out and getting it. 
Oh, uh, because we I, I have to pick and choose which ones come up on stream, Willie. And I'm I'm right now I'm really eating on this uh <laughs> Is eating he? on this this here thing. Brooklyn says his fake Disney castle arrived mint. Oh. That's not bad. Not bad. Mm-hmm. Brooklyn says it's gonna be a two thousand dollar set once it's retired. That's not gonna be a two thousand dollar set. I guess thirty five thousand. Those many figures suck in that set. Yeah, besides Tinkerbell, they're garbage. Garbage. Even though Mick, Mickey is a twenty-five dollar. Um, oh man! Stop it! All right, all right. Stop! I'll stop eating. I'll stop eating. Um, Lego <laughs> creations of charity. Uh, you can go give money to Lego. All this crap. I don't know. Lego video. Oh, what is this? Lego video. Way back in April, Lego announced a new partnership with Universal Music Group. Blah 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 blah. blah. It's not a Universal Music Group. Oh, interesting. So they have stars like Kanye West. Um, Kanye West is not a star. All right, let's get that. Lady, straight. Lady Gaga. He brings in money. And I think they're going to do either something with music or more mosaics. I think that's why they have that license in right. But Lego is Lego is partnering with some mainstream companies to uh, get themselves out like there. Like who? Like who? Like who? Levi's, they did the Adidas shoes. Now they're doing universe, you know, Universal Group, Music Group. I'm just saying they're not just. Maybe they, maybe they realize they can finally, uh, they finally milk Star Wars drive. Maybe they realize that. Yeah. I I don't know. I don't know where they're going with all this this stuff. They're getting out of their own ideas and getting into collabs, but whatever. Legos finally, you're right. Willie's right. Legos, you know, finally did Nintendo. That was a big, you know, Monster Jam. They just got the licensing rights for. They got that away from Mega Blocks or Connects. I think Connects had the licensing rights to that. Yeah. So you know, Willie, Willie, you got a, you got a DC Supergirl. I have finished my dinner. I'm back. Right. I'm back on the screen now. No, it's All, All right. right. All right. All right. Where are you? Who goes up? We need Star Trek. Get out of here. Yeah, get, get out of here with Star Trek talk. All right. Trek. We don't want no Star Trek. What's up, Brick Blaze? Uh, all right, fandom shipping out all this crap. This is crap. Yeah, yeah. You know that. Oh, this is the promotion you got, Brooklyn. Is this what you're talking about? I can see this being worth some cash. I can see this being worth a couple, of, at least maybe 50 bucks. I really think, think, I think the Hagrid is going to be the most gift with purchase this year that's going to be worth the most. Oh, let's, let's look it up real quick. Let's see. Let's see. Lego, Lego, Hagrid, Brick. Yeah. Yeah. 40 bucks, 38 bucks, 33 bucks, 37 yeah. bucks, 37 bucks, 25 bucks, $15 shipping. Yeah. Garbage. 40 bucks. Not, not bad for a $100. Yeah. You know? If you think of it, you spent 100 bucks, you got you know, 30% off pretty much after eBay fees. What do you think the, in your opinion, BR people in the chat, what do you think the most worthwhile gift of purchase was? Do we think the mini micro scale Diagon Alley? That's like a hundred dollars right now. Um, that's a great question. I, I don't know what the best gifts with purge. I, I, a lot of them, they, they do so many that they get clout like clouded into my head. I don't remember. I know that um, holiday ones usually go. Oh, Brick Bear says Darth Revan. Darth Revan? Okay. That might be Darth Revan's what, like a seventy dollar fig? Or says the uh BW Camber bus. Anything VW camera bus automatically gets garbage for me. I hate that set so much. Uh, <laughs> 66 bucks on the Revan. It's probably hard because it's got faked so much. Right. Uh, the Batmobile. Yeah, I do have that Batmobile. Limited edition one, the small one. Yeah. I think that, I think that dropped, though. That probably. was. But that's like an actual good gift. For, I don't know. Anything you get for free is technically all right. But uh, I think the. Uh, the Batmobile is definitely up there. The Blue Fury Hot Rod kit was really cool. That was uh that was a solid one. Not from that, that one's never gonna go crazy in money, but that's that was actually a good giveaway. 
Uh, Amazon Prime Day had Acro Mills George on storage. This is late to the party, not on storage anymore. Any robots review? This is all garbage. The Bat Pod. The Bat Pod. That uh, that's not that that bike thing, is it? Yeah. That wasn't a gift with purchase though. Yeah, right? that was a yeah the inner uh, thing for it. Well, that also came back. That's a great point, Dana. That, that that was like a cool, a cool thing that you could win, right? I mean, it came back like years later on the a giveaway on the uh, what's it called, right? Yeah. All right, the giveaway on that website where you can other uh, the thingy, Lego VIP whatever. You go. Hey, Lego Star Wars Nebulon B frigate. To be sold yeah. on Amazon. Oh, so this is gonna be sold on Amazon. I ordered like four thousand of these. I had to call my my credit line and get a huge increase. No. <laughs> increase. Yeah, I said I need, I need to buy. I need to buy all the seven seven nine zero four Nebulon B frigate. And the guy was like, "Oh, I'm gonna get mine first. It was not a. Uh, it was not a. Uh, it wasn't even on the website. It was a weird title with a with a yellow box that said "Coming soon." Yeah, yeah, you had to and pre-order then- it. And now it's not even on the website. I don't even think if you click, I don't know if he. Let me see if it's still in my order history. I should be still in my order history. Hang on. Mm-mm-mm-mm-mm. So I wonder if they did the pre-order. If that's going to be it, then. You think I, gonna, you think it's going to be available? Done, I think it's done. I mean, I, I'll just be honest. I'm going to be honest. You know, I I don't lie to anybody. I know someone who ordered 700 of them. So, I think they're tied because they're not on the website anymore. Yeah, I don't, I don't know. That's just yeah. I, I just clicked on it. Says, oh, something went wrong. There's a picture of a sad dog on my Amazon app. Uh, no, it's not UCS. It's 459 pieces, but it's a special limited edition San Diego Comic Con 40th anniversary Emperor Strikes Back, whatever the hell it is. It uh, they'll add a little orange and release it next year. Yeah, yeah. This is gonna come out with like a, a, a another set. But, and the uh, uh, and someone on the local selling site did have actual one in hand, and it does have. Yeah, the is that already on eBay seven seven nine zero four? Hang on. Yeah, they already have it. Already sold for one eighty nine. One eighty nine. Just spent forty bucks on it. It's already selling for a couple hundred yeah. bucks. So yeah, it's gonna be a. This is gonna be a hot item. Hot item. Hot. Willie's Willie's talking about Playmobil. I love Playmobil. I love, I love you know Playmobil is great, especially if you can find a train. The trains in Playmobil or the old Vic. Look up whenever you get a chance. Look up the old Victorian house Playmobil. Let's we'll do that on the after hours. That is that is an awesome set. If you uh, like Playmobil, is great. They're they're expensive too. Yeah, I agree. You know the gift with purchase doesn't really thrill me anymore. I mean, I just don't. Uh... I don't know. I have a Lego store like 15 minutes away from me. You know, seven mile drive or whatever it is. It's not even that far, but I just don't. I don't. I don't. I don't get enticed to go spend money to get something for free unless I already wanted it. Right. But. Right. I mean, it's always nice that if you're going, if you really want something in the Lego store, that the free gift with purchase is something that you actually want. Yeah. Uh, to entice you to buy something. It's not, you know. I know that stupid Yoda lightsaber you got for free. That was selling for stupid amounts. Yeah, it was. Uh, this book is shipped out tomorrow. I think some people on Instagram getting this all over the place. I didn't get. Did you get one of these at cheap ass? No, yeah, no. Yeah. Thirty six bucks. I can go pound stands. The book's gonna get yeah, outdated. Yeah. It's gonna get outdated in two months. Not even. I love, I love the art space guy, but I'm not. It's not a forty dollars fig to me. No, no. Because I'm not gonna do nothing with that book. Yeah. Uh, Lego Batman, Will and that Batmobile, garbage, garbage. I think we're all caught up. You caught up. We didn't get the leaks on the Harry Potter stuff, man. Let's try. Let's try the actual. Let's try promo for it. See the guy. Yeah, let's let's put this up on the screen. Looks it does like look trash. trash. I agree. Yeah, trash, and people were buying it in crazy droves for a hundred dollars just because whatever. I don't. Brooklyn Bricks sent me a picture of the Chinese soccer players that sell from like hundred to hundred twenty dollars. Oh damn! So that's that's another gift with purchase that sells for crazy amounts. Looks like there's nothing on here. So is that the new? Sorry, cheap ass. I'm gonna, I'm gonna t- take the screen off. What do you got? What do you got? I don't got anything this week, but uh, just want to tell you that I will be doing. I originally was gonna do a a yard sale at my house, but. 
Uh, I think a virtual yard sale would be better um, just for people that cannot travel to my house. I think and that gives everybody a chance to get, get some in, get in on the action. Yeah. So I will I will be doing uh, a virtual yard sale on November 7th. I think I'm going to start at around 10 o'clock, not too early in the morning, not too November late. November 7th. Is it, are we doing that on my channel? Did, I, did you get my money come through the mail to have that exclusive streaming rights to cheap ass yard sale? I talked to your publicist. They said uh -huh. that, you know, you're good to go. So okay, you're free good. update. So you're good. To I might actually drive down to your house. It's not that far of a drive. I know, but other people can't. And, you know, oh, I would be able to help you help you. I know. I mean, I, I would love for everybody to come in and hang out and see, you know, you know, see what they're actually buying instead of me shipping it. You know, it's a pain in the ass for me to ship. I hate shipping. You know this. Mm -hmm. But a lot of people can't do it. A lot of people can't make the drive. Right. So. I'm gonna try and set it up. It's gonna be a claim system. Oh, claim system! I so like it's that. It's not gonna be like bidding. It's I'm gonna put marks on built sets, box sets, sets and bags. I'm gonna do my best to say complete, not complete. What it's missing? Um, you know, I have over 600 sets to go through. Yeah, you, you know what? If you get a list together, we can figure out some stuff. I can get some get some screen. So, can figure out something. Right. So. Like, I may have a bunch of dinosaur sets, so that may be a lot. I'm not going to say, oh, I have this A, B, and C, D. I'm going to say this is a dinosaur lot, and, uh, you know, at this price. And, of course, the more you buy, I'll discount it, you know, however, you know, we can work it out. But it's going to be first one in the chat that claims it, it's theirs. And that's it. It's not going to be... It's not going to be a bidding. We're not going to go five minutes uh, a bag or five right. minutes. It takes forever. You're going to put a bag full of, you know, Lego city vehicles, $20 claim. Boom. Yeah. And we'll keep it up there. Someone buys it. Next. I like it. Willie, Willie, your dragon, your dragon herd got stolen. That's unfortunate. I don't know how that happened. I don't know. Um, so, yeah, so, I mean, if you guys, of course, you know, if you tell me, you know, what you're looking for, I, I'll make sure that that's definitely in there. I'm not going to throw up, like, a $10 creator set and say, oh, this is $5. You know, right. I may put right. a grouping of five creator sets together and say it's the XYZ price. And then, oh, okay, okay. And then like I said, I'm, 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 I'm happy to work out a deal with anyone. Um but you'll have to bear in mind with me because we're going to probably have a lot of people watching. And I heard up to 4,000 people will be watching it. Yeah. I mean, you know, I think it would be better than just rando strangers coming to my house and seeing what I have in my garage. So Yeah, people bringing uh, viruses and whatnot. Yeah, I think I think it would be better for everyone. And, you know, we'll... Uh, We'll uh, we'll do it. We'll see how it goes. And if if part one goes good, maybe we'll have a part two. You're not gonna, you're not gonna sell. No, no. Day. no. I mean that's like I said. That's the only bad part. Like with people at my house, they can go through the bins and pick out what they want and put together piles. With the claims thing, uh, you know, we're gonna have to do you know a couple sets at a time. Yeah, you know, so it's gonna be it's gonna be a slower process, but everybody will be able to participate because you'll be on the wonderful world of the internet. Okay. 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 Oh, it's two two thousand four hundred fifty three miles for Doughboy sixty four eighty. So a virtual yard sale sounds better. You're gonna, you're gonna get more sales with a virtual yard sale because if you did a yard sale, you're gonna have people showing up being like, "Oh, there's a four hundred dollar module. I'll give you fifteen bucks for it." And, you know, we don't want to deal with that. We don't want to... Keep walking. Yeah, keep walking. I mean, I, I'm cheap, but not that cheap. No, 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 no. I mean, you might have paid five bucks for it, but you're not going to sell it for 15 Yeah, I have your pile started. And Coldwater, I wasn't talking specifically you. You can come over anytime. And, of course, if anybody, anybody that I know, anybody in the chat that is near my house or wants to take the drive down, they can they can set up an appointment with me or contact me. You are more than welcome to come to my house appointment. And, and go through the garage. You know, I, I have no problem with that. It's just people I don't know, 
I kind of feel weird about, I don't want to take, I can't take all the stuff to a specific, like, you know, like a, like a parking lot. Parking lot. So much. You know what I mean? But uh, yeah, virtual yard sale, November 7th, mark it on your calendar, 10 a.m. And we'll, uh, we'll get it going. 10 a.m. That's that's early. I mean early. I could have it at 7 a.m. Oh my god, I'm not gonna be up at 10 a.m. What time? What time is good for you, Br? I wake oh. up around 5:45, 6 o'clock. In the morning? Yeah. 10 a.m. All right, fine. 10 a.m. I'll figure <laughs> it out. 10 a.m. I'm looking on Lego Ideas website. See if there's anything cool we can talk about. Daddy, I I will I will help you out. Hopefully, I I got an account through U, U, UPS, so hopefully it'll be cheaper than last time. Ralph says Ralph asks, "Do you think shipping will be better this time around?" Ralph, you mean shipping time, shipping cost? What do you mean by shipping? I shipped them a small package, and and it went like around in circles for a couple of days. Uh, yeah, it should be better. I think I think the post office should be better by now. Yeah, there was some there was a time a couple. Oh, when did you ship it out? Well, a couple months ago. No, nah, it wasn't that long ago. Oh, yeah. The post office has been pretty freaky lately. UPS has been good for me. I sent a lot of packages by UPS, and they're pretty quick. Um, but the post office, I get stuff from San Diego. It takes like two weeks now. It's like it's it, it's an annoying. Yeah, I don't know. that's Three why. Start at noon. This way, your West Coast fans can wake up and have coffee while buying. You know what? Nothing. Everything. Oh, Ralph said it's still not there. Damn. Um. Well, maybe yeah, I'll just, we'll figure it out. Maybe, maybe I'll adjust it to twelve o'clock. So my West maybe eleven. Oh, uh, twelve is like I don't know. We'll figure. We'll play it by air. You know. We'll, you know. If you DM me and send me thirty bucks, I'll get you in a half hour early. Oh really? Yeah. Oh, there's holiday rates in effect for USPS. What is this garbage about? What do you mean holiday they rates? They raised it like a dollar. I think a dollar. Oh, are you serious? Mm hmm. Are you serious? I'm serious. We're going to be busy, so we're going to jack our price up. Oh, you should be happy you're even busy. Of course. Garbage. Garbage. No. They have to pay hazard pay to all their employees. Uh, let's see. It says it right here. Zone one, da, da, da. Wait. Wait, what? Priority that Mail Express. Every, oh, that's just... I don't care about Priority Mail Express. What's for, where's first class? Where's first class? That's what I care about. Oh, where's first class? Damn, flat rate padded envelope. I thought it already was eight fifteen. No, seven seventy five. Yeah, I think they raised it. Oh, oh, here you go. First class. It's commercial base. What the hell's the normal people? I don't know. I don't know. Whatever. Whatever. They got. They. We, I can't control. It. I don't really care. So, I don't care. Yeah. Just say so, pay with two day shipping. I feel you're getting screwed. Yeah. Yeah, they're uh, they're they 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 shipped on the sixth. Still not there. Yeah, they're so it must have been priority if you did two day shipping. That's annoying, Ralph. That's yeah. I mean, it's it's worst case scenario if it doesn't arrive. I have more poly bags. It's a you know it's a poly bag. It was you know whatever. It wasn't like a UCS whatever you were waiting for. It wasn't a holy crap. It was poly bags. <laughs> it was a Market Street Cafe Corner yeah. line. As a, I think I see you a still Cafe Corner, right? Yeah, yeah. Put that on the insurance claim. I did. I insured it for like four thousand so. dollars. Yeah, I'll split it with you, Ralph. Check out this thing. This has nine thousand five hundred and twenty-two supporters. So this is probably going to be uh, on the brick fan within probably I would say two weeks. I don't know. It's too big. It's big. It's a motorized lighthouse. It's cool, but it's too big. It's too big. Well, what's motorized? Is it the light that moves? The light, yeah, yeah. That's cool. Oh, it's micro scale. Damn it. Hate micro scale. If you guys didn't know that, I do like micro scale. I don't like it. That is cool, though. That is kind of cool. It's too big. Too big. What's this one? Little Venice. Little Venice. Too big. Too big. This one. I think I already looked at this one. Did we already look at this one? No, nah, I don't see that one. I feel like I've seen this one before. It's cool, though. Uh, Willie, it looks like the light moved on it. I feel like I've definitely seen this one before. I don't know why. Culinary art born at home. But this is uh this is very crazy. I work in the kitchen. Did you see the backsplash? Was there backsplash in the kitchen? Was this guy has the sink running? What's this guy doing? Turn the water I off. Dude. The bathroom. Cheap. 
Usually I sing in the shower. I don't know what he's oh, doing. Oh, has that? Uh, that's from the uh, another set that has flop. Actually, let's look at that set real real quick. Let's look up Lego flops. <laughs> Lego flops. Yeah, let's go to eBay. Let's go up Lego flops. Lego sets that just flops. You know what's one of them that comes to mind? Lego exo suit. Exo suit. Yeah, that didn't go anywhere, did it? No, and I have a more than I would like to have of these things. You should unload them as fast as possible. I might have to take a loss on them. Might yes, happen. that is right. Uh, that is right. What up, Bricksmith? Right. What's up, Bricksmith? Giving the woo. <clears throat> um, exosuit. This uh, I remember when this came out. This it is, was this is like, oh yeah, don't, 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 don't you, want, you just triggered me right there. With the, I'll go to the camper van, dude. Everybody was so excited. It's not even a bad set. It's not. It's a cool set. It's a really neat set. It's a really cool set. Yeah. Put one in my pile. Okay, random's good. I'll put I'll put ten in your pile. How about that? You no, know, you know what? You know what set I thought was really gonna do hot? The Tron set. And that hasn't gone anywhere either. Well, it's still available, isn't it? Uh I don't know. I don't know yeah, if it's I, I, I believe it's still available. Hang on, let me check the almighty Amazon. Lego Tron. It's a really cool set. I mean, it, uh, oh, 75 bucks on, on Amazon, so it must be retired. So let's see on eBay here. Yeah, oh, that's another The Green Spaceman. No one's buying that for $75. But the Green Spaceman, I think that's all, it's exclusive to this set, right? Yes. Yeah, so why I'm surprised the XG's not doing better. Uh, Tron, 60 bucks. I mean, give it time. It's just retired. 50 bucks used. It's not a bad deal. I think it was. Two Tron. What was it, 40? I think it was 40 when it, it came was out. 30. Was it 30? Okay. Yeah, I think it was 30. All right, what's the VW camera bus? And this one brings back nightmares. I found, oh, I found my, <laughs> I was going through my sealed collection the other day to get some stuff sold. I came across a sealed stop with camel. Sealed. <laughs> <laughs> Two of my sealed VW camper buses. Uh, That's one of my favorite BR memories from Philly Brookfest. I think uh, that was the first one. Yeah, that was, that was the second one I went to. Yeah, you're walking around with it. Anybody want my stuff with camel? I, I I traded it the cheap ass actually for uh, the mine and some other stuff. Yeah, you did. Oh, this is good. This is a good sign because I I forget what I paid. I think I paid a hundred for mine. That was retail or whatever. What I have was. one of them. Um, that's going to be in the yard sale with only the first and second bag open. Everything else is sealed with the not box. Not a good sign. 126. 140. I have the old box one, not this new box one, too. Hey, I, have, I have a couple of these used, actually. I think I have one or two of these used. Uh, the VW Poly bag. I know the set number by chance. Yeah. Let's see. Uh, but uh, 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 thirty-five bucks, four hundred seventy-nine. Yeah, that one's a whole, always a high end. I think I have. I think I have one of these polys too. Actually, it's probably might be worth more than the freaking set. Yep. I'm surprised they didn't make a minifig scale. I'm surprised they don't. They don't make minifig scale versions of the sets they do the big sets with. Oh, it's always supposed to be for the creator, the creator set. Yeah. The creator, and then oh, they. Sorry. I actually, uh, I actually found my seal. I have a sealed glove world. I actually found that the other day. That was actually my first uh, Instagram post. I have the sealed glove world and the uh, the boat heroic of the deep sealed. My son stole my VW bus. I got it at Philly. Well, Donnie, oh. I got another one for you, man. Got another one for you. Yeah, that's that's how I got mine. Cold water. I got it with the uh, the promo. Yeah. What was another one I found that was surprisingly high? I don't think even I think the original. I mean, this talking wasn't about, high, but talking about poly bags, Coldwater just listed one of my favorite poly bags of all time in his Brickling store. The black, uh, the pearl. Oh, the black pearl poly bag. Yeah, That's I have one of these used, and I haven't. It's not. I don't know how complete it is, but I found one of these in a bulk lot used. The Sop with Camel poly bag is a pretty high end poly bag, too. There's a Sop with Camel poly bag? Yep. I didn't know that. Yep. It's really cool. Sand green. It's another flop I can think of off the top of my head. Another dud when it comes yeah. to. Are oh, you said the research institute? That was. That was. Um, that one's been all over the place. I remember I, I got those and those came out. And 
I sold those for a hundred bucks a couple Christmases ago each. And now they're only forty five bucks. I don't know why this one came back down. To be honest with you. Yep. That kind of boggles my mind. But this was a hot one too when it came out. This came out. This came yep. out with the exo suit. Yep. And then they it, both sold out. It sold out really quick. Yeah. I remember when the DeLorean came out. I, 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 that's my biggest regret is not getting any of the DeLoreans. I remember when those came out. Sealed. Look, you seal 189 bucks right now on eBay. Yeah. Wally is the craziest thing. Wally. Wally. What's what's that one? I know Wally. Sealed. No, I know what it is. I'll just set number. Hang on. There it is. Two what's this garbage box up to? 152. 160 used. Yeah, that's insane. Oh yeah, the shields. Those 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 are those were garbage. Those were a dumpster fire. <laughs> yeah, the, I, I, there's some great some great questions there. The ideas maze. A lot of the idea sets were like just like there was a while where ideas was like almost just like instant gold, but now it's like they just flooded them. Uh, yeah. Maze. Maze goes for a little bit. Does it? Yeah. Oh, I have my sealed Curiosity rover. Today. I have. I got two of those. Is if someone's looking for a used one, I have a hundred percent complete used one for sale. That's maze something. or a curiosity rover? Uh, the uh maze. I have a curiosity sealed rover. Yeah, me too. I want maze a high ninety bucks. What was the retail on the maze? I don't remember. I want to say eighty. Eighty. It's it's a heavy set. There's a lot of stuff in there. Yeah, there's a hot heavy set. The bird one, that was the one too. Yeah, the bird too. I haven't, oh, I haven't seen those in a while. I want the uh, I want the Hayabusa set. That wasn't the first one. Yeah. And then there's a things with ideas that are still being numbered. I don't know about that. And then there's a Japanese idea set that was like the first or second one, even before Hayabusa. It's I like see. I, I someone says Speed Champions. I saw a rumor that Speed Champions was discontinued. I saw it on uh, somewhere. I don't remember where. I think it was. It was probably Instagram. I haven't been on Instagram very much, thank God. I don't know um, why they. I don't know why they would cancel it though. I don't know. I forget where I saw it. Yeah, the submarine cold water's right. The sum. The look up. What's what's the submarine called? Do you know cold water? Do you remember it? The, the Beatles submarine. No, no. There's a a Japanese idea set that was not released in the U.S. It's the official first Lego idea set. If it's not in the U.S., it's not going to be on oh. Shin Shinkai. Yeah, do a Lego search for that. This is their first. There you go. Holy hell! Yep. Five hundred and fifty-five smackaroos. Yep. That's the first official, like Lego ideas set. Yeah, but it doesn't say ideas or Kuso on. Oh, it does say Kuso right there, right there. Kuso. Yep. yep. That's cool. Um, what the fish one? What was it called? Forma. Oh yeah. Oh yeah. One of those flopped Lego Forma. Those I haven't heard about those in a year. Let's see. Some on eBay. Uh, Two hundred. What was the retail on these things? Now that I remember, I think the base set was a hundred, and then everything else was like twenty or thirty dollars a piece, or something like that. So a hundred, hundred and sixty selling for two fifty. Not a bad turn. Yeah. Not a bad turn. I wonder why they didn't like they they didn't do enough publicity i feel for these i don't know i don't think it um took off like they thought it would nothing takes off like they thought it would look at all the stuff they have i don't know i'm just saying <laughs> i would love to know like what lego like research and development is like they're just trying to throw ideas at the wall you know trying to use lego pieces in different ways to get people involved yeah they're trying to change it up when they should just be trying to make them better i don't know Coldwater says if you're looking for him, he has every one of those in the store. Oh. There you go. Shout out to Coldwater. We get 30% of that sale now if anybody buys any. Just put the code Hall in the ball and check out so we get our 30% cut. He just sent me the black pearl poly bag. 
I don't have that in my collection. No, I don't want the Black Pearl Poly bag. I do. I do. That's one of my favorite. Screw new stuff. More X Wings and fire trucks. We're getting another X Wing. 2021. Are we really? Yeah. Wow. Get another X Wing, baby. Yeah. Wow. Uh, <laughs> yeah. Uh, Cold Water does Jason M. Oh, yeah. Cold Water. There you go, dude. Cold Water has it up. There was nothing on here. Mandalorian season two trailer. Star Wars best from Lucas Arts magazine. I don't know. You don't have the uh, new uh, Harry Potter. Let sucks. me go look. Let me go look for some of that. Maybe, maybe they canceled them. Uh, let me go look. Let me go. Yeah. Let me go into the dark web. What's up, Zoom? Yeah, uh, Jason, just hit up Cold Water. He has it in his, uh, I think, Brickling store. He also has the uh, Voodoo, um, the Voodoo Jack Sparrow poly bag. Oversized Ninjago bikes. Yes, those are. <sighs> oh, those are. Uh... Those are something. I don't really think Bionicle took off until they until they changed it to Hero Factory. <sighs> Bionicle still not up my alley. I know you do, Jason. I know you do. I'm looking for the leaks images here. Uh, oh, the oh, this is, we can talk about this in a second. Hang on, on are we for the uh, Sesame Street. No, I'm looking on uh, a different website right now. Look at that piece of trash. Let's see, Lego, honey. I'm going to go 17 wants more helicopters. More helicopters. I want more helicopters. I wonder if this is going to be the last run of Harry Potter sets. Probably because J.K. Rowling's going crazy grandma on Twitter. <laughs> crazy grandma. Yeah, let me look. Let me look on this YouTube leakers channel. I like people leak the stuff on YouTube. I'm surprised they get to keep their channels up. I do one thing. I get a freaking copyright strike on my face. I got a copyright strike on Instagram. Oh, here we go. This guy, this guy is showing it. Hang on. Our buddy yeah, at that one guy foundation. YouTube. Yeah. Yeah, this guy. So Lego, don't don't yell at us, yell at him. Here is the Sesame Street. Uh he shows not, pictures. Not the uh not the uh what's it called? Diagon. Diagon. Boom. From Lego Fan News. Shout out to Lego Fan News on Instagram. They give all the leaks somehow. Um, but that's Sesame Street. Look at that. Look at that. Uh, all you're saying is now the money right there is either Oscar the Grouch or Big Bird, of course. Big Bird looks awesome. Mm -hmm, mm -hmm. Um, but all it is is a facade. It's just that the front right. of the building. That's all it is. Right. I, I can't tell from this picture because it's obviously it's not official yet, but I don't know if there's stickers or printed. I imagine they're probably stickers. The probably stickers and it, the open back is for you know play whatever. Let's see if it does the back. All right, get to the back, dude. Let's see. I don't know. There's one little yeah, like, yeah. yeah. There's one little store to the right of it or the left of it. You get like a street corner with a fire hydrant. Yeah, I don't think the back was ever shown. No, nah, this guy has like that unbox therapy vibe going on with the background and table. Yeah. So shout out to Brick Q Foundation who is using the Lego Fan News stuff. That is pretty much the source of a lot. But anyway, we got these plastic bags here. Oh yeah, that are so, these paper bags now. So these were on a. This is still on a German uh, eBay site. I think he wants That's seven seven thousand or eight thousand. It's not translating. Translate, damn it. <laughs> so those those are what the bags are going to look like from this point forward. Well, it's not translating. I can't read that. Sorry, guys, it's not translating. Yeah, Daniel, they yeah, always back. Yep, they always change it. Yeah, they 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 take the what you give them and they create it and rip it rip it out. Yeah, and the only one that came close was the one they didn't purchase, which is the Ghostbusters HQ. I think you're right, Daniel. I think they do have printed parts, not stickers, on uh, on that. 
I mean, paper bags again. I have no 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 objection to it. No. Care less. Did we talk about the Porsche Mindstorms yet? Yeah, right. I think we talked about last week. A while ago, yeah. Twelve mini figs. Talked about that. Yeah. Yeah. I, you got guess poo. You got poop loaded. I got poo loaded. Did All did right. we talk about the uh, uh, Bricktober in Japan? No, no, we did not. It's, it's Lego Bricktober Japan. 2020. So much for Lego not doing regional exclusives anymore. Did it? Do I gotta find it? Lego Japan. October. I don't know. Uh, nope. No, I can't find it. Oh wait, hang on. Here we go. Exclusive Toys R Us October. Oh wow! Oh wow! I got a new website here. Hang on, this might be a. Uh, New news source. There's so many options for news out there. Yep. Is this what you're talking about? Yeah. Lego exclusive Toys R Us Bricktober 2020 first look. When teacher show up at Toys R Us, Singapore has revealed four micro scale. Micro scale. Again, I don't really like micro scale. Yeah. Uh, models. So this is exclusive to Japan? To Japan, yeah. Or Singapore? I don't know. Look how cool they are. They're pretty lame, but okay. No, they're you get a little you got a little shelf and then they all little roller coaster. I think they're I cool. Know. I mean, I I think they're all right. I'm kind of mad we don't we don't get them though. That's kind of effed up. How much you have to spend to get them? Sixty-five like them. bucks. Sixty-five bucks. Okay. Toys R Us Singapore exclusive. Oh look, a pizza. <laughs> yeah. That's oh, look, a pizza. Yes, C H R W M B agrees with me. These are awful. I agree. Uh, oh, there's instructions for that. That, 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 that. That's pretty much the same stuff as the Brick Fan. Oh, the Toy Fair has been delayed. We already talked about that, right? Yeah, the Toy Fair has been delayed. All right. Go get the get the shit loaded. Let's go. We're ready. And this third week in a row without thick of a train wreck. But hey, 25 people hanging out tonight. Much appreciated. Um, we will be back next weekend. Hopefully, Fick will be back. If I lift his suspension, I don't know yet. He kind of pissed me off the other day. Um, <laughs> just kidding. He had uh, he has some stuff going on. I'm gonna try and get a special guest for us for next week. I think we need to get a special guest for us next week. I think we're gonna get a new new special guest. For us. I think we're gonna we're gonna go we're gonna sell out full simp and go for. Uh, I'll go. We'll go pay some Instagram models to come on our show. Just kidding. Just kidding. You may want I would to like to get on our show. Uh, let's see. I don't know. Who do you want to get? Uh, I'm going to try and ask Leg Bros to come on the show. Leg Bros. Leg Bros. See if we can pick his mind. See how he's doing. You know. But we'll uh, special guest every week. All right. We can try and do it. A lot of people, you know, Sunday nights are with the family, but we're going to try. We can't even get Fick to come on the show. Oh. <laughs> I'm just kidding. Fick is not uh, like a force ghost Fick. Yeah. We, uh, so I'm going to, I'm going to try and get, uh, him on the show and we're going to see how that works. But, you know, be here. And I may I may do a special preview next week in, from the garage. Show off some sets. How about a Lego Master? Lego Master. Do you know any Lego Masters, cheap ass? I know a couple Lego Masters. All right then, maybe we'll get Lego Masters on here. Maybe I'll reach out to my buddy Will Arnett see if he wants to come on the show. I thought you have that restraining order against him. No, that's against Jason Bateman. And I broke onto the set of. Uh, Arrested Development. I uh, got you. Okay. Yeah. Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> All right. Guess who's loading? <laughs> uh, let's see. Who do we got? That's the name. All right. I, I'm not even looking up. I trust you. <laughs> you should trust me by now. Uh, I'm going to look it up. No, you trust me. I thought. Hang <laughs> on. <laughs> uh, looks like that might be the name. Come on. Except cookies. I have brickly. I hate that. There's I always money. In the how many ticks, people? How many ticks do you want to do? First number in the chat, that's how many ticks we are yeah, giving. First that number way. in the chat, that's how many ticks we're going to give away tonight. So, 
Chat it up. Chat it up. Eight. Eight is the answer. That person's getting eight. Eight. Sorry. 25. Back to back 25 is trying to rig the system. <laughs> there they are. <laughs> Ten is the most we'll do on one giveaway. All right. Gas poop starts now. I really thought someone was going to put like a hundred. Ralph the Bruce says nine on Twitter. Nine, nine, would, nine would have worked. I would have, I would have said a hundred. This is this is me, buddy. Butcher, Hades. No hints this week. I'll end it as soon as I see a hint. Phantom. I think that's supposed to be samurai. Classic alien. Samurai skier. Or loosening your shoulder. Kimono girl. Kimono girl got flagged. Yeah, it's anything a girl or boy gets flagged. Crash test. Oh, Rocker girl didn't get flagged. That's weird. That is weird. Hint. 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 Uh, I'll give you guys a hint. It's from the last decade of figs. <laughs> the last decade. Ice skater, ice fisherman. Actually, we did talk about this fig last week in depth. We did actually. I find I'll give that one hint. Yes. So if we listen, if you were here last week and we talked about CMFs, we did. We, we did. did. We did. That's a good hint. <laughs> I hope so. My foot. Not nah, great. I'm gonna get. I'm gonna get flagged for a foot. Yeah. Daddy long legs. Dan, it's isn't it Danny? Danny Longlegs? Policeman I got flagged. It is Danny, but Danny's off the Okay, gotcha. Hockey player. Lizard suit guy. Back to back lizard suit guys. Graduate judge. Yeah. Wow, like man minded AFLs today. Ah, Ralph didn't have power last week. Oh, sorry, Ralph. Sorry, Ralph. Sorry, homie. Sorry, Holmes. Oh, right fielder, constable. I, I got a couple more constables the other day. Actually, I was pretty happy with. It. I, I like the constable fig. It's a good fig. Did you get more uh, stadium done? Uh, yeah, I got some some more stadium work done. Most recent, probably still the video. I got what I posted on Insta Insta Lamb this morning. Okay. William Shakespeare, Peapod Girl, Familiar Clockwork Robot, Thespian, Caveman, Gangster. Okay. Wizard. Ooh, M Lego 17. You're right in the realm. Shut up, Aaron. That's not a hint. Medusa. Medusa. <laughs> Medusa. <laughs> Medusa. <laughs> Babysitter. Cowardly Boom. Nine. There it is. Boom. Boom. Winner. Bay Turner. Winner. Winner, winner. Chicken dinner. Let me text. Uh, let me text out. How many texts was that for? Eight. 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 Let's see. Brick Ovator. Just FYI, guys. I don't know if you know this, but GameStop.com has a bunch of Lego sets that are insanely on clearance. I was actually able to. I went to a Target that I haven't been to in six months, and I actually got one price matched. So I got the Harry Potter clock tower for thirty dollars. How many did you try to get? Try to get more than one. Uh, I yep. told her yeah, I wanted to get three done. She's like, "No, you can only get one." And yeah, one's better than none. Right. So she said one per customer. So I had my wife try and do one. She's like, "No, only one." Oh. Oh, my wife's not a customer all of a sudden. <laughs> like. <laughs> I was like, is this a race? Is this a, a sexist thing? <laughs> it's because no. I'm human, isn't it? <laughs> That's right. Now, uh, so, but for thirty dollars for a clock tower, I will take it. Now, was the was the GameStop thing showing in stock or out of stock? It doesn't show anything. Oh. It doesn't I'm show. Ahead. It says unavailable online, and she they still allowed me to do it. I might go try it then. I might go try to get. Uh, Get you know, just kidding. I don't go out into retail stores. So I, I would see so the best thing to do is go up there and ask first if they'll do it, and then instead of just bringing sets up, I said you guys price match GameStop. Yeah, okay, boom. I'll be right yeah. back. 
Yeah, because they also have they have the uh, Hogwarts Express for twenty four dollars. They have the um, the go the, uh, the hidden side train, I think, for thirty. Oh, hidden side train. Yeah. Yeah. All right, it's eight o'clock here. I'm exhausted. I had a long day of doing absolutely nothing. Um, it is eight o'clock. We're gonna shut this down. Up next on the YouTube internet machine is probably Bricksmith over on the Pink Bug Station train. Uh, uh, drop something, and then after that is probably Brick Dash Slayer. And then after that is probably someone else I don't know. So anyway, that's going to be it for this week's episode of Hall and Bond. Thank you, everybody, that chatted up with us. Next week, we'll have maybe a special guest. Uh, we will have um, hopefully Thick back next week. And we'll get some of that awesome dynamic going again. If not, I'm going to buy this channel out and move it over to my channel. Bye, everybody. See you, guys.